Hello again everyone, Marcus here, I review stuff. Today you're going to see me review a song that I recently listened to on one of my Twitch streams. Uh, Twitch streams are a lot of fun, if you've never checked them out, you should definitely uh, consider checking it out and follow me on Twitch, it's twitch.tv slash Ewok to remember. Anyway, hope you enjoy the song. Let's jump in, this first one actually comes to us from Linda, and it is Self Destructor from Chevelle. Now of course, a uh, big fan of Chevelle, I'd heard a few other songs before ever starting my channel, but uh, since doing the channel and getting more requests for Chevelle, I gotta say, I like their style. So I'm excited for this one, ready to jump into it, and with that, let's, let's do it. Let's go.
what a nice, fun, fast-paced, hard rock song to get us started with our day here. Piano to fade out. Yeah, that was that was really good. I I really enjoyed that. I think um, it has all the all the aspects that I've come to expect and enjoy from Chevelle. The great vocal style, the hard rock instrumentation. I think everything here just worked for me so so well. So again, a very fun, energetic hard rock song to to really start the start the stream off on a strong foot. So um, let's break it down like we always do, starting with the lyrics. Oh, and this is from their new, newest album, Neri, I, don't, I still don't know how to say that, Neriati, Neratius, Neratius. That's cool. You know, I, I got to say, I think the, the songs that I've heard from this album, whether it's um, Good So Long Mother Earth and there was another one we did, Remember When, those two are really, really good songs. And now this third one, I'm like, this is like this album, I bet was pretty damn good. I need to go back and listen to like the rest of it. But so far, I've really enjoyed what I've heard from it. So anyway, uh, how many ways and how many words safe in your lives, but you can't ignore it all. Uh, you aren't at all right. 10 million other lives. Well, it's too much to lose. Oh, it's time or self-destruct. They don't care what the science says. They don't want to talk because this time, ready or not, this time you fought us You fought us all because this time you aren't all, at all right. You aren't at all right. 10 million other lives. How can we save and how in, in this time the lessons we've learned to rescue the mind before it's gone? Well, it's too much to lose. Well, it's time. Uh, or self-destruct. They don't care what the science says. They don't want to talk. So I think the the message here is pretty clear, right? It's like you gotta you gotta trust in the science for one. But it's like sometimes we sort of work against ourselves um, when things are clear. We end up sort of self-destructing, which is you know, obviously where where the song gets its name from. So uh, well, it's too much to lose. Oh, it's time or self-destruct. They don't care what the science says. They don't want to talk. Because this time, ready or not, this time you fought a saw. Because this time you're doubling down. And this time you'll work alone. Because this time you aren't at all right. It's like war. Uh, about your tongue, this Nosferatu ancient ways. It's minimal. These stomach knots, it's conscience. You can't uh, can't hide from his soul till now. It's like war. Uh, go fight yourself. Because oh, this time, ready or not, this time you fought us all. Because this time you're doubling down. And this time you aren't at all right. You aren't at all right. So I think... From what I've gathered from this particular album, again, just for the few songs that I heard, it's very sort of space and sci-fi themed, which I think, uh, from what little I know about Chevelle, I feel like they really enjoy uh, doing a little bit of sci-fi, a little bit of space in their music, and, and I feel like so many sci-fi or sort of like apocalyptic movies and shows and stuff like that sort of... Um, begin with like people ignoring the scientist right <laughs> and then and then the evil thing happens and it's like well we should have listened to the scientist or whatever um, and i feel like this kind of fits in that vein and, and, and considering recent events you know the last three four years um I, you know we've also seen this in our world so there's obvious obvious parallels there but i think the way they approach it here uh you can sort of apply it as a more blanket uh type thing versus having to say like this is definitely about this issue or that issue a lot of times, you know, we don't always listen to the scientist right away. So anyway, lyrically, I thought it was pretty good. I give it two big thumbs up. Um, as far as instrumentation and vocals go, again, I always I always enjoy Pete's vocals. Um, I feel like he, he started the song off really sharp, like a little bit sharper, I think, in tone than he, he normally does. But I think throughout, he, he does another fantastic performance here. Um, and then uh, instrumentally, again, I've really come to sort of expect and enjoy um, the harder rock stylings from Chevelle. So that guitar, the drums, I think everything here worked well to, uh, to just make a fun and, and interesting song to listen to. So uh, instrumentally, vocally, two big thumbs up for me as far as replay value goes. You know, ju like just about every other Chevelle song I've heard on the channel, this one's easily making the playlist. And it, it's that perfect song for just kind of rocking out, jamming out, and, and, and really enjoying their, their, their styling 
playing here. So two big thumbs up for me for replay value. Overall, a fantastic song and a fantastic request. Thank you so much for your request. Let's keep it going. This is a good way to start the day. All right, I hope you enjoyed that video. As always, if you enjoyed the music as much as I did, go support the artists. Go listen to their music wherever you can. And if you'd like to support the channel, you can just do all the normal stuff you do on YouTube. Like, subscribe, and comment. You can even check the description to follow me on Twitch, Twitter, or TikTok. All right, guys. Again, hope you enjoyed the video, and hope to see you in the next one. Bye for now.